Hello guys, welcome back to my another After Effects tutorial, in this tutorial, we are going to see, how to create, golden logo reveal animation in After Effects, so without any wait, let's see the preview. Here I have already imported my logo and image file, you can download the image file, from the link given in the description. Here we will create 4 separate compositions, background composition, glossy logo composition, white transition composition, and at the last, logo animation composition, in which we will merge all 3 compositions. So without any wait, let's create our first composition. Name it as background. As usual set width and height to 1920 by 1080 pixels. Make sure frame rate is set to 30 frames per second. Set time duration to 6 seconds. Now let's create a new solid. Name it as gradient. Now in effects and preset, search for gradient ramp. Add it to solid gradient layer. Here we need to change the start color and end color. Set start and end colors as shown. Now make sure you are at start of the timeline. Now create a keyframe for start ramp. Let's adjust the position of star tramp. Perfect. Now at end of the timeline. Change position for star tramp. You can see the preview. Now at start of the timeline. Create keyframe for end of ramp. Let's adjust the position of end of ramp. Now at end of the timeline. Change position for end ramp, as shown. Perfect. Now change ramp shape to radial ramp. You can see the preview. Let's set ramp scatter to 300. Now in effects and preset, search for tint. Add it to solid gradient layer. Now change map white color to black. Change amount of tint to 15. Now for gradient layer, press T to bring up the opacity. Now at start of the timeline, create keyframe for opacity. Change opacity value to 0. Now at 1 second, change opacity value to 100%. You can see the preview. Perfect. Now let's recompose it. Name it as RAM. Now let's create duplicate of RAND composition, press CTRL plus D to create it. Now for RAND composition, change mode to screen. Now let's create a new solid. Name it as noise. Now in effects and preset, search for fractal noise. Add it to noise layer. For fractal noise, change brightness to near about minus 22. 
Now in transform. Change scale value to near about 276. Now at start of the timeline. Create keyframe for offset turbulence. Now adjust position as shown. Now at end of the timeline. Change position as shown. Perfect. Now you can see the preview. Now on your keyboard press Alt key and click on Offset Turbulence Stopwatch. Enter expression. Wiggle 1,25. Now on your keyboard press Alt key and click on Evolution Stopwatch. Enter Expression Time 200. Now you can see the preview. Perfect. Now in Effects and Preset, search for Fast Blur. Add it to Noise Layer. Change blurriness to 5. Select repeat edge pixels. Now let's pre-compose it. Name it as noise. Now for AND composition, change track mat to, luma mat noise. You can see the preview. Perfect. Now create a new adjustment layer. In effects and preset. Search for curves. Add it to adjustment layer. Now adjust channel red and blue, as shown. You can see the preview. Perfect. Here our background is ready. Now let's create our golden logo composition. Now let's create a new composition. You can also press Ctrl plus N to create a new composition. Name it as golden logo. Now keep everything as it is. Perfect. Here we need to add the image file. You can download this image from link provided in the description. Now for image layer, press S to bring up scale. Now let's scale it to fit the composition. Now in effects and preset, search for offset. Now add it to image file. Now at start of the timeline. Create a keyframe for shift center. Now at end of the timeline. Change center as shown. Perfect. Here you can skip this step of adding reptile, if you don't want to create reflection of the image. Now in effect and preset. Search for CC Repetile. Add it to image layer. Now place Repetile effects above offset. Now change tiling to unfold. Now let's increase expand right value. Perfect. If you want you can skip this step. You can see the preview. Now in effects and preset, search for tint. Add it to image layer. Now let's change tint amount to near about 38%. Now search for curves. 
Add curves to image layer. Now adjust the curves as shown. Now search for fast blur. Add it to image layer. Change blurriness to 6. Now let's pre-compose it. Name it as reflection. Now let's add logo to the timeline. You can scale your logo if needed. Here I will slightly scale my logo. Now let's pre-compose it. Name it as logo. Now for reflection composition. In effects and preset, search for CC blob eyes. Add it to reflection composition. Now in blowiness, change blob layer to logo. Change property to alpha. Change softness to 9. Change cutaway to 5. Now let's hide the logo composition. Now in light, change light type to point light. In effects and preset, search for curves. Add it to reflection composition. Now you need to adjust the curves, exactly as shown, to get a perfect golden logo. Perfect. Now for reflection composition, change track matte to alpha matte logo. Perfect, here our golden logo is created. Now change reflection and logo composition to 3D. Now let's create a new camera. Now create a new null object. Change Null Object to 3D. Now parent the camera to Null Object. Now for Null 1. Press R to bring up rotation. Now create a keyframe for X rotation and Y rotation. Now for X rotation, change rotation angle to near about 35 degree. Now for Y rotation, Change rotation angle to near about 40 degree. Now at 3 seconds. Change X rotation and Y rotation to 0. Now select end keyframes, change keyframe assistant to easy ease in. Now we need to adjust speed graph. Now change graph mode to speed graph. Now adjust the speed graph as shown. Perfect. Now for camera. Press P to bring up the position. Now at 3 seconds. Create a keyframe for position. Now at start of the timeline. Change position value as shown. Perfect. Let's see the preview. Perfect. Here our golden logo is created. Now we need to create wipe transition. Press Ctrl plus N to create a new composition. Name it as wipe. Now create a new solid. Name it as noise. Now in effects and preset, search for fractal noise, add it to noise layer. 
Now in Transform. Unselect Uniform Scaling. Now increase scale width to near about 280. Scale height to near about 40. Now let's add logo composition to the timeline. Now in effects and preset. Search for fast blur. Add it to logo composition. Now change blurriness to 100. Now in effects and preset. Search for fast box blur. Add it to logo composition. Now change blur radius to 420. Change blur dimensions to vertical. Now in effects and preset, search for curves. Add it to logo composition. For alpha channel. Adjust the curves as shown. Now in effects and preset, search for gradient ramp. Add it to logo composition. Now adjust the start and end ramp as shown. Now for logo composition. Change mode to multiply. Now select logo composition and noise layer. Pre-compose them, name it as wipe noise. Now create a new solid. Name it as wipe. Now in effects and preset, search for fill. Add it to wipe layer. Change fill color to white. Now in effects and preset, search for CC image, wipe. Add it to wipe layer. Now add 3 seconds. Create keyframe for completion. Now add 5 second and 10 frames. Change completion value to 100%. Now in gradient. Change layer to wipe noise. Change border softness to zero. You can see the preview. Now in effects and preset. Search for fast blur. Add it to wipe layer. Change blurriness to 5. Now we need to hide the wipe noise composition. You can see the preview. Perfect. Now let's create our final logo composition. Press Ctrl plus N to create new composition. Name it as logo animation. Now add background composition to the timeline. Now add logo composition to the timeline. Perfect. Now add wipe composition to the timeline. Now for logo composition, change track mat to Lumo inverted mat wipe. You can see the preview. Perfect. Now add golden logo composition to timeline. Now in effects and preset, search for glow. Add it to golden logo composition. Now change glow threshold to 80%. Change glow radius to 35. Now change glow operation to screen. Now in effects and preset search for camera lens blur. Add it to golden logo composition. Now at 2 second. Create a keyframe for blur radius. Change blur radius to 0. 
Now at start of the timeline, change blur radius to 25. For golden logo composition, press U to view created keyframes, now select end keyframe. Change keyframe assistant to easy ease in. For camera lens blur, select repeat edge pixels. Now let's add wipe composition to timeline. Now for golden logo composition, change track matte to luma matte wipe. Now you can see the preview. Now let's create a new solid. Name it as display. Change color to black. Now for display layer, press T to bring up opacity. At end of the timeline, create keyframe for opacity. Now at 5 second, change opacity value to 0. Now create a new solid. Name it as frame. Now draw mask as shown. Change mask mode to subtract. Perfect. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Here our golden logo reveal animation is created. Thank you guys for watching this tutorial. If you like this tutorial, then make sure to like and share this video, and also subscribe to my channel. Thank you.